impacts on Ohio? Zero. Okay. In fact, as the hurricane begins to come in and move away, it's going to kind of draw the weather away from us, which is going to set us very nicely for a Labor Day weekend. Temperatures are going to be cooling off briefly, as you'll see in the forecast hour by hour, but then warming right back up just in time for Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Hour by hour today, a little bit of high overcast, some of those thin cirrus clouds, and certainly not the kind that produce any precipitation, and occasionally getting a little bit of sunshine through, so no complaints this evening. Temperatures are riding right around 80 degrees. That dew point, very comfortable. 53. I would take those two numbers any day of the week, 80 over 53, and we're carrying a light breeze out of the west at about five miles an hour. So a very comfortable evening. Walk the dog. They want to cut the grass or just sit in the back porch and have a glass of iced tea and relax. Anything you've got going on this evening, you're going to be just fine. Numbers a little cooler, relatively speaking, by a degree or three outside of Columbus, but everybody ending the day on a very comfortable note. But enjoy it because we get through the next couple of hours. We're going to see some changes coming. One of the things I noticed today, just how the, the water eyes and the runny nose. The weeds are growing like crazy with the weather we had last week and then the cool nights and the afternoons and the sunshine. The mold is low and the grasses are low, but I expect the weeds to be a problem as we get a little further into uh, late August and into September. Now, hour by hour tonight, as soon as that sun sets, temperatures dropping down through the 60s, we're going to see the clouds coming back in and kind of slowing that temperature slide right around 60 degrees when you wake up tomorrow morning. The one thing that's also going to be different tomorrow morning are the winds coming out of the north at about 10 miles an hour, and that's going to really keep temperatures in check. Notice the afternoon, 71 degrees by 5 p.m. We're 80 right now, so in a relative sense, about 10 degrees cooler than we are today. Uh, so for tomorrow, that's going to set the stage for a cool midweek. Hour by hour for Thursday, another cool start. Yeah, those are some 40s out there, but watch how nice Thursday ends. We're going to be right around 70 by lunchtime. Still a bit breezy, but wall-to-wall -wall sunshine expected and a real nice finish on Thursday afternoon. Temperatures in the low to mid-70s. So once we turn that corner tomorrow, we're gradually going to see improvement all the way into the weekend. And that includes another for the third week in the row, Dom Tiberi. Another nice night for Friday football. Warm at tailgating, 80 degrees. Kickoff, 7 p.m., 7 and then as you're rounding out the game, 73 degrees by 9 p.m. Now, here's the details into the weekend. Tomorrow, just a very slight chance of a shower north and east, 20% chance. Many of us will stay dry. Thursday, wire to wire, we're dry. Friday, 82 for a high after a cool start. Saturday and Sunday, 87, 89, 91. And we're going to take a run at the 90s next week and stay a little hot and humid as we get into the first full week of September. But overall, the one thing to keep in mind with the heat, the rain and thunderstorms are going to be few and far between. So stay cool and seek the shade. But Mother Nature is not going to provide much help.